All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Tower of God, episode three. Um, I'm not going to say a lot before, as per usual, because I already talked about it through the opening, the previous episode, but I'm very excited for this episode, very on time for it today. So let's just get straight into it right now. Everything good, everything's good. <clears throat> Right, open it straight away. So, what I can recall from the last episode is Bam Kuhn. Is that how you say his name? Kuhn? Kuhn? Kehun? And Rack decided, well, they kind of forced Rack into it, but they decided it was best to form a trio to venture into the next level. And uh, they're at the water wall kind of thing, magic wall, where everybody was tested to get through. Obviously, Kung and Rack got through very easily, but Bam, luckily, <clears throat> never got pushed back through the wall. So by that, we know something's up already. And it wasn't luck. What what we know from it, I don't know. But uh, Kung seems to think something's up. So does the... Oh, I can't remember what the position's called. It's a uh, floor leader or something. I've forgotten already, but... Yeah, he th he seems to think he's interesting. He called him a monster, I believe. How was that? Yeah, this this intro bops every time, I think. I'm I'm getting really, getting really into it every time I hear it. I think it could be a lot better, but it's pretty awesome. So let's get into it. Oh. Oh, so he's royalty. Well, he could have been. Oh, I see. Kun, right, okay, Kun. <laughs> His faces. <laughs> hey, that dude's just like Zoro. What the hell? <laughs> Wait, so he's here for what reason then? <laughs> because... Oh. Right, okay. Okay, so this this is what a fake sky? Turn this up a little bit. There we go. I mean, the kind of is. But, you know, if you're letting your 
trust in people push on to Bam. And Bam seems pretty trustworthy. Probably is. <laughs> what the hell is this? I feel like he's telling everybody this, but he's giving them the wrong kind of hint. What a weird character. Okay. Okay, that seems viable. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Ooh, he knows who he is. Boy. Pop him. Pop him. <laughs> Rack, calm down. <laughs> what is this guy? He's just a plastic bag. Oh, that, that eye cyclops thing. Got through, obviously. That sound. It's from um, the sound effect from uh, Blood Blockade. I recognize it. Right. What's he said? He said... You need to think... You need to open the right door. Twelve doors. Ten minutes. My God, what is wrong with Rack? <laughs> He's making coffee, tea. What is wrong with calf? Calf, <laughs> Rack. <laughs> He's He's making a latte. And it only points to ten. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Can I like? 
That's better. Calm down, bro. Bam, just open a door. Rack. <laughs> you fucking rack. <laughs> nice. What was the answer? Of course it is. Got the deductive power. I mean, we did get help from the plastic bag. Trust. That's true. I'll take the leap. I like the OST. Yeah, what is in that bag? <laughs> or is that just like a metaphor? <laughs> Oh. So, wow, okay. He's smart without the plastic bag guy telling him? Or did... Did you... Did, did the guy tell the guy in the tracksuit? So did he only give it to Bam's team? That's nice of you. Is this Rachel? Oh boy.
I love you. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. <laughs> I know this guy's a voice. Lucky boy. <laughs> sure, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I like the character designs. <laughs> well, this one might be. Okay. Huh. Hmm. Seems too good to be true. Oh. Oh, so it's like uh, the King's game. Got it. <laughs> okay. So isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I see. So you've got to be basically in the throne by the end of the first round. But then you've got to keep it for the whole second and third round. Right? <laughs> oh, Rachel? They want to play the first round. Well, wow. Jesus, he should put him in. You should put him in the chair. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's see some fights. Probably not. Is she going to kill him? Oh, I'll just knock him out. Kill him? 
Knock him out. Kill him. <laughs> oh. Oh, she's abusing him. God damn. It's a weapon like his. Oh. <laughs> oh. What is she? This dude picked the right team to be on. Or one of the right teams. Interesting. Has it already been five minutes? Is Oh boy. Oh, that's cool. It is Rachel. Obviously. <laughs> uh, okay. Hmm. What's going on here? Oh, it's over. The ending song's nice. Boom, boom. It's so dark today. What's wrong with my camera? It's because I'm sitting far back. All right. Let's have a look at the ending, shall we? All right. So that was Tower of God, episode three. I keep going to say season one, but this game seems quite interesting and they're playing for a bonus round. And I can't, I don't fully understand what climbing the tower means yet because I just assumed it was kind of like, like in my mind, I was thinking of like, I know it's weird to compare it to, but I was thinking of Sword Art Online where they had levels and levels and levels and they had to do challenges or fight bosses or something on every level. But it seems like they're just doing these tests and then they just get to climb. So they do the tests. Then they climb, and whatever they have to fight on the levels aren't part of the tests. They're just obstacles to get through. I don't know. I don't fully understand it yet. But that's okay, because it will leave me surprised, probably. Uh, but nice episode. We find more about we find out more about Kun. Uh, Rack's funny. I love Rack. <laughs> Um, I'd be surprised if he, like, even had, like, a proper backstory of Rouge, just, like, this funny-ass lizard dude, crocodile dude, lizard dude, um, but, yeah, what is the thing going on with Rachel, I don't know, or Rahel, as he says, I thought she'd already be up there, I don't know why she was behind him, maybe it's just someone that looks like her, I don't know, tough to say, but, yeah, Overall, a pretty good episode. I liked it. Um, don't have really much anything else to say, so I'll leave it there. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did, and I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.